Uh, over the weekend, we started to see a modest decline from that peak last week in the number of lives lost. Over the last 24 hours, 45 lives lost. That number down from over 100 uh, just a number of days ago. We did see 1,300 new individuals test positive for COVID-19, but we're also seeing substantial improvement in our total testing. Now over 553,000 tests have been performed. Uh, the number of hospitalizations, 1.4% increase. Um, again, we're seeing some stabilization, decrease, modest increase, decrease, modest increase uh, in the total number of people hospitalized, the number of people on ICUs basically flat uh, from yesterday, just one individual um, more than in the last 24 hours. But let's keep it that way. That's why I began talking about the beaches. And those are the images we saw over the weekend, the images down in Orange County and Ventura County on our beaches. Those images are an example of what not to see, people what not to do. The reality is we are just a few weeks away, not months away from making measurable and meaningful changes to our stay at home order. That is a very optimistic point to emphasize. However, that's driven by data. It's driven by behavior. This virus doesn't take the weekends off. This virus doesn't go home uh, because it's a beautiful sunny day uh, around our coasts. Newport Beach, I want to acknowledge uh, their city council. I want to acknowledge the County Board of Supervisors in Orange County. I'm told they are looking to consider some augmentations uh, and uh, some more deliberative engagement uh, to address the conditions and those concerns that uh, were highlighted over uh, the course of the weekend. But I want folks to know this as well. Uh, we're doing the same at the state level. The California Highway Patrol with our stakes par state parks uh, patrol with other partners, uh, and we will avail ourselves to more aggressive enforcement uh, of the stay at home order, of the social distancing. Uh, tomorrow, we're gonna break down uh, the number five indicator, which goes to uh, our business environment, uh, goes to schools and childcare facilities uh, and the like. Uh, those two states have joined our Western States Coalition. In addition uh, to Colorado uh, and to Nevada, of course, uh, the partners partnership that was formed a few weeks back with Washington State and Oregon. Uh, this now allows all five states to begin to work even more closely and more collaboratively. Also want to update you just briefly uh, on a new strategy uh, that we'll also be employing in terms of getting to the next phase uh, as it relates to meaningful modifications of our stay at home order. Uh, we're inviting the press uh, and others in on a series of digital uh, roundtables that I'll be hosting uh, with leaders in small businesses, medium and large businesses by sector, also bringing in customers uh, and bringing in experts from our advisory committee. But it's really about talking about the future and what that retail experience may look like uh, a year from now, two, three years from now. We've been working very hard on these unemployment insurance claims. Some $4.4 billion has been distributed, $4.4 billion uh, since March 15th. Later this week, uh, we will be putting text uh, capacity to answer questions by text. Uh, we put a new chat bot up a few days ago on the most frequently asked questions. 